Shall we go? Yeah. And I walked to the nearest water fountain. Once we fill up the water pitcher, we turn to the classroom. Okay, do you like oolong tea? Never had it. Anything is fine. Uh, very well. You already set the temperature of the kettle to 200 degrees. Now it's time to get the teapot. You really do this properly, don't you? Of course. I shouldn't do any less when I'm making tea for others. Even if I'm not an expert or anything. <laughs> In that case, you'll only be even more impressed. Perhaps I will. You already fetched your teapot and begin measuring the tea leaves. To my surprise, she even started humming a little to herself. You must be in a good mood now. Is that so? I was letting it show. And you notice, I was doing a bit of thinking. And I've decided I would try expressing myself a little bit more. It's not, um, not very hard for me to do. When it's with you who's around anyway. Ah, that's great, Yuri. You don't push yourself too much. You're always worrying about me, Inki. It's very endearing. That's... Yuri wasn't kidding. I don't even know if I can keep up with this. I will actually pour a cup of tea for each of us. Inky, I have another request. Do you mind if we sit on the floor today? Why's that? It's a little bit easier on my back. I can with my back against the wall, rather than bending over at my desk. Sorry, I didn't realize. No worries, I just have a back pain fairly regularly to, as I, to do, I do my best to manage it. Is that so? I wonder what that is. It's more likely because of my tits. My... your posture, right? I always hunch over like... That's what I'm reading. Yes, I have terrible reading posture. That's why we should sit on the floor. Fair enough. I'll go ahead and get the book. The book from my bag. Ah, I have some chocolate as well. The back of small chocolate candy that I kept in it for Sayori Candy Radar. <laughs> I like Sayori though. She's kind of cool. If, it, if, I, if I had to choose, it would be Sayori, uh, Yuri, Monica, and that's okay. It takes it. I'll go well with the tea. Yuri and I then sit against the wall, tick up at our side. As if in sync, we assume the same reading position then as last time, each holding one half of the book. Except this time, our body are even closer to each other. I can't see too well. Yuri slides closer until her shoulders are touching. Am I supposed to focus on reading like that? Yuri was always kind of cute, but... When she's being less apprehensive, it's almost more than I can handle. Your teacup. Yuri tends me to holding it with my hand is not holding the book. I end up in a position that's making it even harder to focus. Because now I need to worry about...